Okay, okay everyone, it's Opel and welcome to the second part of the tutorial requested by the Pokemon Mater. How to make my sidebars. This is, we've made our sidebar in GIMP and I will get it out later when we need it. Um, but first you're going to need to sign a Vegas link in the description. I've, yeah, I did find one. Let's open it. You will see my personal details and I don't really care if you can see my name. Yes, that is my official name. Please be gay and search me up. Okay. Um but that's it. You don't need to do and if you ask to hurt my feelings, it would really annoy me if you did search for my service personal details. But okay. Okay, my account does exist. And why are you not responding? Please respond. Thank you. Oh, cancel. Okay, so I will see you when I get it open since it has been a problem. And I know, and I know, really do have it open. So all you're gonna need now is first open a video. Any random, 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 random video. Um, say for example, just go on. Actually, to be fair, it can be anything. Do I still have the default? Oh, no. So, um, hmm. uh, okay, I have my thumbnail video for Emerald. That'll, that, that'll do me perfect. It might, it's a, quite a big video file, to be actually honest with you. Oh, by the way, also for this, you may need, you will need this as well it's called Windows Task Manager just search it up on how to get that and you should be able to get it okay next we're gonna go to options well good no enter 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 video track and you're gonna want to move this video up then you're gonna click on number two and select it then you're gonna file open and look for your picture and I have no idea where it is um, so to stop that I will when you find I will pause the recording for when you find it when I found it so see you guys in a minute okay so I have my yeah, and you're gonna drag all this all the way to the end of the video so all of that should be equal then Oh. Right click, properties, untick, maintain aspect ratio. Click OK. Drag and hit this button here. It's called event pan crop. Untick that box and you will be able to edit the size of your video. Um so yeah, you can edit the um, the amount. But before we do all this, so oh, control Z, all of that. Once you've dragged it to the end, what we do is you hit this preview button, the project video properties, and we go and change this to twelve eighty by seven twenty. You go onto the frame rate and type in 30.000. You go to your quality and type in best. You change this to square and then we're going to save it. Then you press apply and you hit OK and you should. Um, this will be the actual size of your video. Next, we can do all the editing and such. So let's get going. 
um, and I will speed this up, so see you guys in a minute. So guys, at about that, that's where your screen is going to go. Um, so yeah, into that screen box, and if you uh, go to the beginning and play it, well it doesn't want to play for me, but if you hit play, it should play in normal opportunities. Um, next, the way to do this is insert more video tracks um, the way to make moving sprites is just the same as this I'm not going to do moving sprites so for example you caught a oh. a metapod in your walkthrough and it doesn't want to respond so let's see you when it works Okay guys, we have got it back and because of that, we are now so awesome. We've got a meta part picture right here. So, in this picture though, we must have oh, properties. I maintain aspect ratio on. Uh, but, let's go and event pan crop this image. Sorry, I just had a little fault in uh, Sony Vegas. And that's why I just did that. Um, anyway, you're going to want to make sure this is ticked now. Uh, and if you. There, there might be a slight problem like that. The way to fix that, you've got to make it the right size first. I picked Metapod as a good example of Pokemon. That's about right size. So you think? Oh, see? Um, if you want to drag it onto the first pop ball. Um, the easy fix. You've got to make sure that it's completely there. Then you're gonna hit this button right here. It's got track motion, and it will allow you to drag it without doing that. What was just happening, and there we have our Metapod. You can save that, I'm not going to save it because I don't need to, and save it as first Pokemon, and that will put it there. Um, so, yeah, you can add badges exactly the same way. Um, yeah, and that's basically how to do it. This was a short part, but yeah. So, that's how I do it anyway. But there is an add on. You're going to want to make it into a different file, you're going to want it as render as. You click on render as, select where you want to render it as, um, but don't save. You're going to want the save type as the bottom one, Windows Media Video version 9 WMV. Then go to any one of these you want. Customize it. Actually, I'll just use mine. Um, and then press custom. Change the name to YouTube HD, and I put this as I made this for YouTube. You want the video rendering quality at best. You want audio to be at. You want to have include audio ticked. Um, mode CBR format. Windows Media Audio 9.2. Uh, attribute. 62 um, kbps. Don't know what that stands for. A lot of people are following you, you stupid idiot. Um, 44khz stereo a slash v. And you want a CBR. So basically, that uh, video CBR again. Windows Media Video 9. High definition. You want the size as being 1280 by 720. You want the pixel aspect ratio square. The frame rate must be 30, frame per second free. 
that doesn't need to be ticked. If it is, you want it at sharpest. So always have the video at sharpest. The bitrate, I want to take all of them except internet LAN and have it as 5M. You don't need to change anything here. You can do all of your details, but I'm not gonna. And then you go to save template. I'm not gonna authorize it. Once you've saved it, hit OK and have it selected as YouTube HD. Call it whatever you want and then get ready to save. Now, if I wanted to render this now, I'm not gonna really render it, but obviously, I'll, it might finish before I do this. Oh, um, whoops, sorry. I want to open my uh, Windows Task Manager and you want to go to Applications and you should have the uh, Sony Vegas. Right click, go to, go to Processes, you should and right click on Vegas 70, uh, Set Property, uh, Real Time, and it should just change it to Fast. Oh, unable to set real time, so we probably just set to high instead, and that will, and then you can hit the X on this, and that will make it render faster. So, yeah, I can cancel that now. Thank you guys for watching this little short tutorial. And um, by the way, every computer has Windows Task Manager. What you do is press Control, Alter, and Delete, and it should be on the bottom amount of options. Oh, so yeah, that's how to make my sidebars. Thank you for this request from the Pokemon Mater. That's also a shout out to you. So, thank you guys for watching my tutorial. Peace out from RPL.